So guys, first things first, we're gonna go ahead and meet our cast. We're gonna get off into their traits, and we're definitely gonna talk about their um what they're gonna major in and a little bit about their first personality. So the first sim that you see on the screen, her name is Haley Dela Cruz. Now Haley kinda comes from uh, another let's play I was gonna launch on my channel in 2019 that'll be the first link down in the description where I did a whole thing of her family she was a teen at the time but now she's a young adult getting ready to go into college so Haley's gonna major in fine arts and when I say major in fine arts I mean she's gonna be into street art painting you know it kind of goes into cooking the guitar culinary music film all that good stuff and that ties into a lot of our LP. So she doesn't have a career or anything. I haven't applied her for university, but let's go ahead and go through some of Haley's traits. So Haley is a slob. She does not clean up after herself. Uh, she don't care about her surroundings. It is what it is. She's gonna leave plates everywhere, spoil food, rotten food. She's cool with that. Of course, she's into street art, painting, sculptures. That's what she's gonna be in school for. We're gonna try to sell some things so she can get some Somalians and different things like that. Haley is artistic obviously again i tried to do a lot of things that i wanted to relate to her degree she is definitely a party animal as you can see by the whole fit party animal for real and got the little skirt on with the boots my hardest part about this whole lp is gonna be the camera and Haley is also childish her favorite color is orange her favorite food is steak and she loves kids music and Haley is an aquarius so that's everything that we need to know about Haley de la cruz again she is roommate number one and we do have eight roommates in the whole dormitory so let's go off into amber so this is amber like i said give me forgive me for the camera this is amber amber is our sim that we see right here her name is amber sandrake and Amber is a bookworm. Amber is a bookworm. She's neat. She's athletic. She's a green thumb. She's very friendly. Amber's going to major in physical education. So her lifetime wish is pretty much perfect mind, perfect body. Amber is all about eating healthy and cooking and being like a professional athlete and like all things professional sports. Okay. Then the next thing we're going to go ahead and talk about is going to be Tamara. Tamara is flirty she's a great kisser she's a genius she's a perfectionist she's ambitious she kind of look pregnant right here but she's not but tamara is all of those things she also doesn't have a career she didn't well, she got a high school diploma because she came from another family of mine but tamara is an aquarius as well her favorite color is sea foam like white she loves cookies and latin music and i forgot to tell you guys what okay um Amber is also an Aquarius. So we got a bunch of Aquarius in the house. Maybe they're all Aquarius. I don't know. So that so far is the three ladies. This is the three ladies we have. Now getting off into some of the males over here. They're kind of like in weird poses because I was doing like a photo shoot or whatever. This is Christian Soriano. Christian is a Pisces. He is a party animal. I'm talking about he's going to be so lit. He's a party animal. He's handy. He's a daredevil. He's a heavy sleeper. He's a computer whiz. His favorite color is lime. He loves hamburgers. He loves electronical music. And Christian wants to be an international super spy. <laughs> he, he wants to be a police officer. He can join the military. But he's going to major in technology. And I think I forgot to tell you guys what Tamara's going to be majoring in. Tamara's goal is to be a world renowned surgeon. Like she already got some things that she wants going on. But Tamara's going to ma uh, major in science and medicine. Here we have Thailand. Thailand is flirty. He's a perfectionist. He's a hopeless romantic. He's a heavy sleeper, so you're probably going to be missing that alarm clock when it comes to going to school. He's childish. His favorite color is red. He loves sushi. He loves classical music. And his goal in life is to be the leader of a free world. A free world. So he's pretty much going to be off into politics. So we're going to have Thailand major in communications. And it definitely say join a political career. I did a lot of thinking when it came to these Sims. Next we have Butter Simmons. Butter is a couch potato. She's a party animal. She's handy. She's a daredevil. She's a heavy sleeper. Her favorite color is red. She loves spaghetti. She loves indie music. Butter is a Gemini. Hmm, period. And she's also going to major in communications. And uh, her lifetime goal is the jack of all trades. She knows she wants to major in communications, but majoring in communications could also be writing, like books, photography, journalism, politics, fortune teller, just depending on what expansion pack you pay into. Our next sim is savannah mccall now savannah is our city girl <laughs> savannah is a city girl um she's a workaholic she's a great kisser she's irresistible everybody loves her she's a party animal she's a vegetarian her favorite color is pink she loves cookies she loves pop music and savannah's lifetime wishes to be a professional author savannah's gonna write 
books. Like, Savannah's that girl. No career or anything. She haven't went to university yet. And last but not least, our last sim is going to be Colson. Michael is his name. He's a workaholic. Colson is always working. He's a party animal. He's a natural cook. He's a hopeless romantic. He's very, very lucky. His favorite color is white. Spaghetti. Latin music. And he's an Aquarius as well. His goal is to be a CEO of a mega, mega corporation, so we're going to have him major in business. He also doesn't have a career as well. Um, I just placed these guys into here so I can kind of like get a shot of them, but come to find out, I'm not good with the camera, so <laughs> it doesn't really matter. I could have left them all over the lot, but first things first, I need to go ahead. I forgot to tell you guys some of their zodiacs, but anyway, first things first, I need to go ahead and put like a door in here so they can come out. And I seen the mascot on you know, I haven't played the Sims in a minute, so I can't even remember where nothing is. But I seen the mascot on the porch. So I know first things first, they have to everybody has to apply for a university. And if I remember correctly, I'm not gonna get any freebies out the box or none of that. If I remember correctly, um I don't know if they need a computer to apply. I can't rem I can't remember y'all. I haven't played university in a minute. My game be lagging out. Okay, so I'm gonna have every sim come take the test. The aptitude test. I don't even know what it's called, y'all. I usually be this gonna keep popping up, so ignore it. Um, I got some corrupt files going on. I gotta <laughs> find out what that is in a minute. Cause all eight of us are definitely going to university. That's the point of the game. We are not living here. I'm gonna have to cheat a little bit and put it in a motherboard so I can afford everybody's tuition. But as far as when we get to university, the rest is on us. Mm. You see everybody's scores. I had them sitting in pose player. So we see, I'm, I'm kind of trying to get familiar with their names a little bit. We see Haley is the first person to come take the little test. So my game is definitely glitching out right now. Look at all this. Like the walls are cutting. This is crazy. Um. How long does it usually take for him to take this? I ain't gonna rush him. Who, I wish he'd go home. I'm not a fan of the mascots. It really aggravates me. One thing about The Sims University that I just didn't like about when I would play it is everybody being all, like, into your room and having to lock the door. I just didn't like that. I was n I've was, i never been a fan of... Oh, it actually looked like they're taking a test. That's kind of cool. I've never been a fan of everybody being in your room and different stuff like that. What's going on with her? Who is this? It says, congratulations on your Sims test score. Enrolling in university is as simple as using a phone or computer. No scholarship awarded. Haley De La Cruz should consider improving her skills and career progress to earn a university scholarship. But she did get six credits for fine arts. So, actually, I'm going to write that down. I'm really particular about my game. I don't know where I put my pen, but I'm going to write. So, Haley scored a 766 out of 2,400. No scholarship. But, again, she's getting six fine art credits. I don't think that's too bad. Um, use a computer to apply. Okay, we're gonna do that in a minute. Ooh, this is a cell phone. That's pretty dope. This is aggravating me. <laughs> who's next? Who's next? Who's next? Okay. It says no scholarship was awarded, but Amber, she considered improving her skills, blah, blah, blah. So Amber scored a 849. Out of 2,400, that's higher than Haley scored, and she got six science credits. That's not bad. That's actually pretty good, even though that's not her major. That's pretty good. Everybody's gonna apply for university. Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? It says Christian. Christian scored a 766 out of 2,400, and he got six uh, technology. Um, <laughs> credits. Let me see. I have it written down. I can't really remember. So yeah, Christian is in school for technology, so that's really good. So Christian got an extra six credits for when he do decide to enroll in university, which he's about to do it anyway. So that's pretty good. I like that. Who's next? It's like they're all getting the same score. Um, Savannah. Savannah is going to school for communications. No extra credit. What? Aw. But she scored a 766 out of 2400. So Savannah might be in school a little longer than everybody else. She's just not that strong in other topics. Which is okay. It's okay. You never know. You never know. Who's next? Who's next? Who's next? We got four more people. Well, we got three more people taking the test. Uh, who's this? Thailand. Thailand is also a school for communications. He scored 
at 766 out of 2400 and he got no extra credit so tyler might be in school just as long as amber <laughs> no scores for him i feel like i feel like um tamira has been taking her test the longest wasn't she the first person i called over here i think who is this butter oh my god butter got the lowest score of them all butter score of 683 out of 2400 she's supposed to be in school for communications and she also got no extra credit i feel like everybody that's in school for communications is just not getting any credits at all they're not even getting credits in communications i don't know why but butter is not it's not looking too good for butter but if we go back and look at butter's traits and things like that um she's a heavy sleeper in a party animal anyway and a daredevil on a couch potato so she might not oh my god who is this Tamara, period. <laughs> Tamara scored a 1347 out of 2400. It says, earn a partial scholarship. Tamara will receive a thousand simoleons per term for the next time she enrolls in a university. Okay, hold on, because Tamara did her big one. So, look at her score. I mean, Tamara scored great in everywhere. So, for business, she got six extra credits for science and medicine. Remember, she's going to be a doctor. So, do we really expect a score to her? Yes. She got an extra six credits. And for communications, commu I see Tamara being a schoolgirl. She got six plus credits. Wow. So, Tamara definitely scored the highest. And she got a scholarship. 1K per term. I knew it took her forever. That's good. I, I like that. I like that for her. I like that for her. Who's left? Hold on. Did everybody take the test? No, where's Colson? Colson did not come take the test. What is he doing? He's coming to share a secret, but he haven't taken the test. Um, take the test. What the hell? Oh. Somebody having love right in front of our face. Girl, calm down. Okay, so y'all, we got uh, Colson taking a test to see where he plays. Can y'all hush? <laughs> To see where he's gonna place, because he's the only person that didn't take one, and I don't, I don't know why. Oh, yeah, I don't know. It's not showing too good. Oh, it's like he's having a really hard time. Well, Colson. Yeah, Colson is fighting for his life. Okay, what is all this talking we doing over here? Like. What's going on? Colson scored a 766 out of 2400, which is pretty much where everybody else scored. Wow, Colson got no extra credits, no business, no anything. You know, he's going to major in business, no scholarship. So Tamara is our only one that got a scholarship. So now I'm going to go ahead and have everybody enroll in university. It looks like they have a bunch of things already lined up for themselves. Somebody complaining on somebody. I don't know, but we're going to go ahead and take Savannah. I have her enroll in university. Uh, Tamara is about to enroll in university. I'm gonna have uh, Colson enroll in university. Oh, I can. Oh, I can just send everybody. I'm gonna have them all call one by one. But it's looking like I can send everybody. Now I'm gonna have to. Do I have the money? I think I have the money. Uh. We're definitely going to do two terms. 36 what? 36 sim days? Is it days or 24? Let's do 24. So Savannah, what did we say Savannah was going to do? Savannah was going to go to school for communications. So let's click on Savannah. Let's go to communications. 24 terms. 36. Let's do 24. Let's not get crazy. Haley was going to go to school for fine arts. Uh, she's kind of right there, but she's going to do two terms. Amber is going to go to school for physical education. 24 terms. Tamara got $2,000 in financial aid. Okay. Period. <laughs> Tamara is going to go to school for science and medicine. Uh, Butter, we're sending her to school for communications. Okay, 
Christian, we're sending him to school for technology. Colson, we're sending him to school for business. So we're gonna stay on business. And then Thailand is also going to school for communications. Don't ask me why everybody got communications and all this and all that. I'm gonna have to put in a mother load, like I said, guys. Oh, I don't have enough. So I'm gonna go ahead and put in mother load, come back and do this, and then I'll pick back up the footage. All right, y'all, I fixed it. 15,000 total. Let's check it. Are you sure? Yes. I'm positive. All right. We're getting ready to go. Enroll university. So, who is this? Oh. Ah, uh, that's Amber. They all meeting up. <laughs> Colson said, I'm getting my bag. Colson got his bag. We're leaving. We're very much leaving. Oh, you all pulled up. Truck pulled up. Graphics messing up. <laughs> okay. We're leaving. We're leaving. We're, we're, we're leaving. Everybody come on for you get left behind. No, guys, I didn't go through the box and do any freebies or anything like that. Because usually when I do that, they get like a t-shirt or something. It'll change their clothing. You mean to tell me they put all of these Sims in the back of this one truck? I guess they did. So, guys, we're going to go ahead and go off to university. I'm going to speed it up a little bit. I don't want my game to lag, but... We're going to go ahead and go off into university, and I'm going to let this low, and I'll catch you guys back once it's finished up. I think my favorite part about our whole dorm is being able to see, like, the university campus. But let's go back to our dorm. So we got some regular houses or whatever. But this is our dorm. So here's a full shot of our dorm. Really cute. Uh, let me see if I can give you guys, uh, like, a little 360. Uh, not much going on, but ooh, I see him coming in through the back door. We do have some things going on in the back uh like a table area here this area is like uh some more seating and things like that and then in this little house area <clears throat> we have where you can paint and then over here we have bonfire so that's that but i think my main thing is going to be showing you guys the basement i didn't really renovate the basement but i want to go ahead and show you guys the basement so what i mean by renovate i've already renovated this property before i moved them in so Spoiler alert. <laughs> That's a fact. So here's our basement. <clears throat> we got a whiteboard here. Pool table here. We got a uh, cake machine here. Chug a little bit. <laughs> Games here. Stereo here. There's a whole room and bed down here. I did not know this was here. I promise y'all I didn't know that was here when I was uh, decorating. Otherwise, I would have remodeled it. Whatever. Um, and then we have a photo booth. So, downstairs is kind of spooky looking. We got a restroom and dead looking. So, it's actually a five-bedroom house. I thought it was a four. Um, on the first floor, I didn't do too much renovating inside of, um, like, the study room, the living room. I didn't really do too much there. Uh, over here, we have, a like, the kitchen area. I didn't do too much here in the kitchen. Uh, not much at all. I added some cereal to the counter, but that's about it. Upstairs is where a lot of the main stuff is which is where everyone's bedroom is. So every Sam has to share a bedroom, obviously. And so the first bedroom that we're looking at, this bedroom is um, Tamara and Christian's bedroom. So I'm gonna actually go ahead and, can I, uh, can I claim this bed? Like I can set ownership, right? Set bed ownership. This one is gonna be for Tamara. This is Tamara's side, side of the room. You see all the science -y stuff here. I'm so tired of this pop-up. When I finish this video, I'm definitely going to get this fixed, whatever that pop-up is, and get it out of my game because it's aggravating me. Uh, over here, like I said, is Christian's side of the bedroom. So I'm going to go ahead and set ownership here for Christian. Uh, okay. And then, uh, in, the, in the hallway behind us, we have Amber and Haley's bedroom. Uh, Amber being the pretzy girl Amber obviously has the pink bed okay and then on this side we have uh, Haley which is can I not do all this shit right here yes I can she is for the arts and different things like that so she got like a kind of artistic room um, on the other side now all of the rooms I did renovate for the most part on the other side of the house, we have, and I want to say Kristen and Tamara shares a bedroom because we have five girls and three boys, and so that's just how I did it. We are going to set bed ownership to Tylan and Colson is going to share a bedroom. So Tylan, and then here, why does it just randomly say woohoo? 
the freak. And then in this bedroom, last but not least, we have Savannah and um, butter. Uh, so the pink side, I think I wanted it to be Savannah's for sure, and then this side is gonna be butter. So yeah, that's that. Okay, so let's get into game. It looks like they are all coming in through the back door for whatever reason. Uh, I don't even know what they got going on over here. I don't care what anyone else thinks. I think you're hot. Oh, so... Butter is pretty much making a move on Thailand. Already, I guess. This is... this is Now, I think this was happening back at home, if you look like in the beginning of the video. You kind of seen them kind of hit it off already. Uh... This is <laughs> new to me. Um, I do know that Thailand is a hopeless romantic, and I do know that. But Butter doesn't have any romantic traits, which doesn't mean anything, but she definitely got it going for Thailand. But, so we're not going to let, well, Butter actually can join the science career. I don't know who this is, but she want to send a text to somebody. So we're going to let her do that. Um, but this is, this is new to me. I, I don't, I don't, I'm going to let them do them. Um. Savannah is spending a lot of time with Haley, as they should, because I think I wanted them to be best friends, I think. I really got to learn how to work this camera. Oh, girl, put the things up. I'm going to send Tamara to introduce herself to Colson. Because I feel like that's kind of the angle I want her to go here. So we're gonna like introduce ourselves. Let's just ask him about his day. Oh. Let's just chat a little bit. Nothing crazy. I don't want to come off too strong, but that's kind of like the direction I want her to go in. Uh. Yeah, I definitely gotta get this out of my game. This is aggravating me so much. Like, what the hell? Um. Oh. Uh, Haley is not liking, uh. Mm. I kind of want Savannah to bark up that same tree, though. <laughs> so I want Savannah to. Give him a wink at him. Give him a little wink. Give him a little wink. Give him a little wink. <laughs> we give him a little wink. Man is like literally that girl. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. If you made it this far to the video, comment 777 down in the comment section below. Uh, I just want to thank you guys so much for watching. I didn't want the video to be too long, but we're going to go ahead and pick up right where Zena's left off. Don't forget to subscribe. Love you guys. Signing out. It's me, Cameron Awani. Bye.